Hello and welcome back. Today I will be trying on jumpsuits from ASOS. They literally just came in this morning. We have some inexpensive options and some expensive options. Let's put them on my body. <laughs> The first one is by the brand New Look, and this is their ruffle strappy jumpsuit, and I got it in a black. It looked really cute, simple, and perfect for spring, and I paid 32 US dollars, and this is made out of 100% polyester, and I picked it up in a size US 4, so hopefully it fits. I am slightly obsessed with this jumpsuit, honestly. I was kind of hesitant to try it on just because it's very wide leg. I thought maybe it would swallow my petite frame. For reference, I am 5'3". And this is so pretty. Just the way where the legs cut off, I think it's really flattering. I love the ruffle sleeves. And the size, it is a little bit big. I kind of have to make sure it all sits up, but I like that you can tie the waist, cinch it in to kind of show off your figure a little bit. I think this jumpsuit is stunning. Confirm yeah, me. Looks elegant. Yeah, he said this jumpsuit looks very elegant. The only thing I wish it had were pockets, but I'm not mad because I love everything about it. I love the V-neck. I love the back also. It's nice and open, but not too open. You can wear it to an elegant dinner with really nice high heels, or you can strap on some sandals and wear it to the beach or a day out to brunch. I love that it's extremely lightweight. Even though it's black, it's very flowy and I know I'm not gonna sweat in it. I was checking in a bunch of stores and for $32, you can't find too many options around the $30 or $20 range just because it's kind of like a dress in a way, jumpsuits, it's a top and a bottom. So you're getting two for one price kind of deal. So I think for that price, the quality of this it's pretty good. It's a little bit above average. Just because the sizing is true to size, the material of this is actually really good. It's really fine and thin, but yet it's really opaque and you can't see through it. The one thing that's really bothering me is the length of the pants. If you look, the right side is longer than the left. I think just because the way they design this, it's really flowy. So if you're walk or you're just kind of doing your thing, you won't tell. But if you stand still and the pants kind of settle down and don't move, you can tell that they're very uneven. So I think that's kind of where you see the quality issue a little bit. But overall, I'm very happy with it. And I think it's a really cute spring summer piece that you can just throw on and you look fabulous. Next jumpsuit is super cute. I'm excited to try this on. This one is by the brand Boohoo and this is their tie front open back floral jumpsuit. Sorry about that. <laughs> I paid 49 US dollars and this is made out of 100% polyester. And I picked it up in a size US 4. Here's the second one. It's very revealing in the front. So I'm just gonna keep the bow like this. So let's talk about this, what I love and what I hate about it. I think it looks very fun. It looks very spring, summer. I love the sleeves. I mean, that's just so cute. I think it's stunning. I love the print. I love the color. I love the back. The back is stunning. I think it's very flattering on my butt, on my back, and just, it looks really nice in the back, but then you go in the front and you have a lot of weird stuff happening. The first thing is this right here. The zipper is in the front there is the zipper and then what happens is it creates weird stuff down here because the print and the color kind of camouflages the camel toe which is good but then from the side there's extra fabric and then the zipper is just hanging off and then it, i don't know what's happening here i think this is so so ugly i have a very short torso so if you have a longer torso than me, it might be even more flat right on you. But no, this is definitely not a keeper. All right, let's move on to the next jumpsuit. I keep calling them dresses. <laughs> this next one is by ASOS brand and I got it in their petite size. And this is the wrap front jumpsuit with peg leg and I paid 60 US dollars. And this is in the color nude. And this is made out of 87% polyester and 13% elastane. And I also picked it up in a size US 4. This one looks really elegant, but really cute. Hopefully it's not too revealing. <laughs> All right, so we're to start. I don't think this particular jumpsuit is flattering on my body type because I do have hips and a butt. So it's kind of clenching two parts. It's tight right here, but then there's so much extra fabric right here where it's just kind of sitting sagging in a way and then you turn around it looks pretty good on the butt but then there's so much extra fabric right here but it does look good on the butt though this right here i would definitely need some kind of boob tape to keep the girls in place it's definitely very low cut i hate when necklines like this 
this little part right here, this little wrap portion, it starts to rotate and it's so unflattering. It does fit true to size. I mean, it fits really good. It's not too tight on my waist. I do like that you can cinch it in even more. You can wear it. You can wear the sash in the back. You can wear it in the front. It's really cute. And I do like that the straps are adjustable so you can make it more loose or you can plump them up. Fabric is actually really nice. It kind of has a good weight to it, but it is nice and stretchy. But for me, I don't think this is flattering at all. Next one is really cute. This is by the brand River Island and this is their double-breasted tailor jumpsuit and I paid 87 US dollars and I got it in the color white and this is made out of hundred percent polyester and again I picked it up in a size US 4. Let's try it on because this looks really stunning. This next one I look very smart and business-like. I feel like I need like a ruler or something. <laughs> I don't even know how to explain this suit. I'm a very sophisticated painter that came to paint your house or it looks like I work in a laboratory with buttons. I think the look of this is very smart and business you're very concealed everywhere. I do love the double-breasted buttons. The only thing, that is how you get into this jumpsuit. Literally, you have to take every button apart to jump into it. So going to the bathroom, that might be an issue if you really gotta go. You might just gotta go in it. It is also very see-through and very inconsistently see-through. So it is lined right here in the front, but it's not lined in the back. And then it's lined with your waist down. And then you can see this little fold right here. It looks very ugly because you can see through it. So you can't basically wear underwear with this or if you wear underwear, very nude underwear. Yeah, I don't understand what's happening. Like, what is this? It looks like I'm wearing granny panties, but this is the lining. The concept is stunning, but it does look very cheap and unfinished. For $80, I expected this to be completely opaque. I mean, you're wearing a white jumpsuit. I think the back is nice. I think the butt looks pretty flattering. <laughs> this leg has less fabric. As you guys can see, this one has a lot more fabric. Like, I don't understand what's happening, honestly, in this jumpsuit. Like, what is going on? So you're not having any luck with jumpsuits. No, so I'm not. Hey, the first one was pretty good. I actually really like the first one. True that, first one was okay. I really hope I don't love the really expensive ones because so far these cheap ones are not giving me life. This next one is by the brand Free People. I love their clothes. It's so good, good quality. And this is their Shining Sun Tie Up jumpsuit. And I paid 100 US dollars for this. And as you can see, I got it in the color orange. And this is made out of 51% linen and 49% lyocell. And I picked it up in a size small. <laughs> you guys, I have failed with jumpsuits from Amazon. <laughs> I can't even look at myself. <laughs> Now I really came to paint your house. Not gonna lie though, this is so comfortable except for this little portion right here. It is really riding up. I don't know what is going on with my body type and jumpsuits. Any of other short girls have issues with jumpsuits? I know a lot of tall girls have issues with jumpsuits, but me, I'm short. Wow, this is so unflattering. <laughs> I do like the back though. I think the color with my skin tone is not flattering me, but the front, I don't know what's happening. I promise it looks cute on the girl on ASOS. <laughs> I don't know what to say. The sizing is huge. You see the way it sits. It looks like I'm wearing a balloon. I'm gonna go jump skydiving, but then you tie this off. It kind of gives you a waist, but then it creates this right here, this floppiness. Wings on my thighs. Who doesn't want wings on their thighs? I mean, come on, so flattering. I mean, the quality of this, I really like free people quality because they wash very well, they wear very well for a very long period of time. I love their linen pieces. I mean, it is ridiculously lightweight. It does have a weight to it, but it is very lightweight and it's very comfortable. It's very, you can move in it, you can kick, you can paint a house in this. I mean, you can do a lot of good stuff with this, but for $100 to look like a painter or an inmate, is it worth it? Maybe. You tell me. <laughs> All right, let's move on. Hopefully the other ones are much better. I am now... You, you said that about the last one. <sighs> Guys, I'm losing hope. This next one is by the brand Coast, and this is their Ruffle jumpsuit, and I paid 188 US dollars, and this is in the color Cobalt. It's a stunning blue, and it is made out of 100% polyester, and I picked it up in a size US 4. I'm like, I don't even want to try these on. They just keep getting worse and worse. This color is really pretty and I like these ruffles. It's giving me like a very modern look to this jumpsuit, but it does look like a really unshapely dress on me. <laughs> the seam for the crotch is extremely low. So it's making me look like I have a very saggy crotch. It's never a good thing, you guys. But the back is really nice. 
I think this is my second favorite one <laughs> out of all of them, even though it's not sitting as well as I would want it to. For example, right here, there's so much extra fabric, but it's like tight right where my boobs are. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe my body is just not made for jumpsuits. And that makes me sad because I love jumpsuits. The quality of this jumpsuit is actually really good. The zipper is really nice. You have the nice zipper in the back. The sleeves are stunning. I like that it's nice and secure up here. It's not gonna keep falling off. The material is kind of heavyweight, but it's very flowy and it feels very comfortable on. It's not giving you a camel toe, but it is a little bit long on me. So I think if you have a little bit of a longer torso than I do, this might, be very flattering on you. Next, we have this brand Sunku or Sunco, and this is their wide leg jumpsuit with a tapestry tie, and this retails for 250 US dollars, and this is in the color blue jeans. The body is made out of 100% polyester, and then the lining of the body is 100% viscose, and I picked it up in a size two. All right, this is second to last, and I don't hate it and I don't love it. I'm so sad because this one is super cute. I love the color, I love the material, I love the little embroidery that you have on the sides right here. It's actually open. I mean, make sure you maybe have like nipple pasties or something because you can see through it. I love this little belt that comes with this jumpsuit. The material, it has a weight to it in the bag, but once you put it on, it is a very lightweight and it feels very comfortable. There's stretch to it. And once again, the crotch area is super low. I think the back is super cute. I really like the back of all of these. This one has a little bit of extra fabric hanging off. This one is just a very loose, lightweight, comfortable looking jumpsuit that's really cute. But I think it would look better on someone maybe a lot skinnier than me and a lot taller than me. Maybe, I don't know. But for me, it's not very flattering. The quality of this jumpsuit is superb. It is seriously stunning. The actual material, it feels so good and expensive. Overall, the quality is really good. And last but not least, this is by the brand Paul and Joe Sister. It's their retro floral bloom jumpsuit and I paid 458 US dollars. Why? I have no idea. And I actually bought a belt to kind of cinch in the waist. So this is in the color green and the body of this jumpsuit is made out of 100% viscose and the lining of this jumpsuit was made out of 100% cotton and I picked it up in a European size 36. I actually kind of like it a lot. The only thing is this right here. It's a little bit small on my boobies, so I'd definitely have to get that tailored if I were to keep this, but I am not hating it. I love the 70s vibes it's giving me with a super wide leg and they're kind of longer. And this is the belt that I bought. It's not, it doesn't come with the jumpsuit. It's just a cute little waist belt. I need to add extra holes to it though. It's on this last hole and it's, it's just sliding off, but it definitely looks cute with the belt. And you guys, it has pockets. That's what you get for buying almost the $500 jumpsuit, you get pockets. <laughs> it feels so good, it's so lightweight, and the material is really soft and comfortable. And just the way it flows, I think it flows so nice. I feel like you can really dress it up or dress it down. The only thing that's bothering me is this right here. The quality of this one is definitely the best out of all of them, I would hope so, for this price tag. But the only thing, this right here, I, I'll keep saying that because, I mean, my boobs aren't that big. I think it's definitely for girls with a smaller chest area. All right, so there we have it. I'm honestly shocked. I thought I would look much better in jumpsuits. Reality's kicking in, you guys. I think I have to make terms that jumpsuits are not the most flattering thing on my body shape, my body type, but that's okay. Well, this was kind of a fail. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video nonetheless. Maybe if you do look good in jumpsuits, you got some great ideas because I think they were all really pretty, except for the orange one and the white one. But other than that, thank you for watching, spending time with me, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.